Hey, Ando again from senseiando.com. Balance. I get lots of questions about balance, usually from people who are having a hard time throwing high kicks. Well, good news. I've got an easy solution for this. Stop throwing high kicks. See you next time. Yeah, I know. High kicks are fun. Besides, balance is important for every martial artist, whether you're a high kicker or not. In self-defense, if you get pushed, pulled, knocked down, or you fall down on your own, that usually makes a bad situation even worse. So today I've got one simple exercise, simple but a little crazy, one simple but crazy exercise to help you improve your balance. My first martial arts teacher was a guy named Bruce Lee. Maybe you've heard of him. In his collection of notebooks, The Tao of Jeet Kune Do, he wrote down this advice. Feel yourself in a balanced state. Feel the difference by putting yourself in balanced and unbalanced positions. Unbalanced positions. Hmm. He also wrote this. Balance might mean being able to throw one's center of gravity beyond the base of support, chase it, and never let it get away. Now, I can't be sure what Bruce Lee meant, but for me, the big idea was you shouldn't always practice your skills the right way. You should also practice them the wrong way. That's because sometimes the best way to learn how to do something is to learn how to not do something. So my advice, if you want to get better at finding your balance, go throw yourself off balance. Seriously, try this. Instead of losing your balance by accident, lose it on purpose. Just throw your center of gravity around, chase it, and try to get it back. The goal here is not to look cool, obviously. It's just to get better at finding your center and catching your balance. Yes, I know, it looks crazy, but it works. It works because instead of trying to hold your center, you're actively finding your center. Think of balance as a verb, not a noun. Instead of trying to maintain a perfect frozen state of being, keep moving, keep adapting, just like you would in a real fight. Now let's change this drill up a little bit. This time, pretend you're in a real fight. Take a big punch, give a big punch. Too big. Don't worry about being perfect. Take that pressure off yourself and just have some fun being imperfect on purpose. Get hit, fall down, throw terrible techniques, and be the worst fighter you can be. Hey, want to be even worse? Close your eyes. Closing your eyes helps in two different ways. First, it makes recovering your balance more difficult. Second, you won't be able to see everybody laughing at you. You'll still hear them, yeah, but at least you won't see them. So take Bruce Lee's advice, or my interpretation of it anyway. Find your balance by spending some time losing your balance. I think you'll find there's a lot to learn by being imperfect on purpose. If you like this video, hit subscribe. But to be really sure you don't miss any of my new videos, find the link to sign up for my free email updates list. Until next time, go knock yourself out. Then get back up and keep fighting for a happy life.